It is the 3rd of the 2nd, 2014. This is your radioactive reality. So all my hardcore news fans out there, uh, please bear with me while I do these cooking videos and uh, other things on my channel. Uh, just being silly with some of my friends and uh, trying to have fun a little bit. Uh, feel free not to view those videos. Um, on to the news, e, e News. Kyoto, government to dump Fukushima plant gr groundwater into the Pacific Ocean once plan is approved. Senior scientists, no one believes, claims by government labs or TEPCO about releases. Quote, there's a shattered trust there, unquote. And it's been reported over and over again that uh, they've been dumping water illegally. <sighs> Investigation of deformed fuel assemblies from Unit 4 pool at Fukushima. Confirmation of cracks due to mishandling in the past. Uh, they're still going on about stuff that happened before 311. Famous actor Peter Crocodile. You might remember him by, uh, he was the, the sympathetic scientist in ET. Fukushima is dumping nuclear fuel into the Pacific. Plutonium named after the devil, view of nuclear advocate, a little psychopathic, entire biosphere at risk from these poisons, fatal to everything with replicating cells. Definitely, uh, you know, preaching to the choir there. Underground water skyrockets from not detected to 1.7 million becquerels per liter of strontium-90 and other beta radicules. Uh, and it to me 125 now showing up. TEPCO changes measurements from under analysis to out of range. Don't worry, folks, they have everything under control. Japan government advisor on Fukushima. We have much to learn from what's happening at Chernobyl. Engineer, all my co workers at Chernobyl are now dead, and I had thyroid removed due to cancer. From all those bananas, boys. Official tons of Fukushima radioactive waste in area beyond Tokyo, 150 miles from reactors, higher strontium levels there than spot one mile from Diachi plant. Southern wind directions and rainfall expected relatively high activity levels. Uh, we've been reporting this on and on and on again. Uh, good luck with those Tokyo Olympics. Nuclear engineer, very huge catastrophe for melted fuel to burn into the ground. Radioactive material, quote, will go all around the world once in underground water. It's already been in there for 1,060 days every day. Chernobyl made cement barrier below the reactor. Fukushima did not. And it's, and it's sitting on top of a river right next to the Pacific Ocean with the strong ocean current just offshore. CBS San Francisco widespread distrust of scientists over Fukushima. Official quote, people are worried. People want to know what's going on. U.S. Berkeley professor admits much of his funding is from government. If you don't trust us, who is it you want to trust? Says man-made cesium-137 is natural background radiation. These are the guys we're going to trust because there's nobody else to trust. Wall Street Journal, potentially lethal strontium-90 is moving deeper into groundwater at Fukushima. I wonder why. Levels rising. Radioactive material spreading below underground wall next to the ocean. Record high on the other side of final barrier by unit number three. And again, these corium have left the building. They don't stay in one big blob. They branch out like tree roots. With the river running underneath Fukushima and flushing that right out into the Pacific Ocean. New York Times widespread public distrust of NHK over Fukushima radiation cover-up. Report President's resignation last month related to cover coverage of nuclear issues. Former NHK employee speaks out, quote, gross political interference. They control the press. 
More damage being discovered in Fukushima reactor number one. Remember they put that 38 million dollar little lead boat down in there and checked everything out. Destruction at containment vessel concerned about tons of water draining from unknown cracks and holes. Nuclear engineer even worse news at Fukushima plant. Radioactive water has formed pathway and is flowing straight into the Pacific Ocean. NHK broadcaster quits in protest over nuclear issues. Professor censored after 20 years on the air. Was to reveal extraordinarily high damages. Newly installed NHK chief. Enthusiastic to help spread government message to the audience. Don't worry folks. Everything's completely under control. Robot data reveals hole in unit number two suspected to be almost 10 square centimeters. Highly radioactive water draining out of the bottom of the containment vessel. You think? TEPCO model shows molten fuel barely underwater. That's their models. They've been uh, bullshitting us with for a long time. Uh, temperature irregularities started earlier this month. And of course they have an all too familiar graph. West Coast sea stars melt into mush, just vaporized. It's the change of my lifetime. That is a very understatement. Ripping themselves apart, innards spilled out like the matrix. That many species, that widespread, is just scary. Makes me wonder what's next. Possible Fukushima fallout is involved. Possible. It's all part of the big picture. BBC Ukraine on the brink of civil war. Government threats to blow up nuclear plants. Facilities on high alert after seizure of energy ministry. Basically the government's saying, you know, we're going to have terrorists come blow up these nuke plants if you people want to take your government back. Yeah, because the people want to blow up and live in Chernobyl land. County officials in California approve action on Fukushima, quote, an international crisis of epic proportions. Monitoring and testing requested for West Coast. Just another day at the office, folks. Map shows Fukushima fallout in U.S. Radiation dose in Northeast and Great Lakes equal to the West Coast. Experts shocked by what they saw in video of reactor number one. Radioactive water flowing down the side of containment vessel. Fukushima Daiichi's hidden crisis. And of course that's the video we've all seen. I, I even posted that on my channel. Discrete accidents took place at Fukushima that released radioactive material into the Pacific Ocean over the course of the summer. Discrete accidents, huh? Those are the ones they don't report about. Scientists back from Japan, I've seen data showing highest radioactivity levels in the ocean that have been observed recently. Nuclear waste may be leaking directly from the buildings. Not going into, uh, not only going into groundwater via the tunnels, it's going directly into the Pacific Ocean. Over to Daily News, Fukushima Diary. Good news. TEPCO increased unit price of electricity and made 190 billion yen of ordinary profit for third quarter, fiscal year 2013. TEPCO's profiting. TEPCO's profiting. How TEPCO is treated in nuclear industry, blah, blah, blah. Cesium-134-137 levels spiked in 21 elementary school ground soil samples in Kamakura in 2013. You know, they're lining these elementary schools with water bottles to help soak up the radiation and protect the kids. Tritium density continuously increasing upstream of, under, of groundwater bypass well since October 2013. Don't worry, every nuclear power plant in the world releases tritium all the time. Yay. TEPCO plans to discharge tritium into the sea up to 330 million becquerels. 
that's about all I have for you today. Of course, if I missed anything, please let me know. Uh, attach your comments or send me a message. Enjoy while you can, everybody. Thanks.